Mumia! Free Mumia! Free Mumia! I've been coming to these for a long time. But less time than some people and more time than others. And I'm gonna tell you the first thing that somebody told me the first time I came to a Free Mumia protest almost 19 years ago, so almost 20 years ago. There was a brother on stage speaking and he said, you know what, I've seen a lot of people come and go. I've seen celebrities, I've seen actors, I've seen singers, I've seen famous people come and go. Sure, they stay a little while, they say thank you very much, they, they appreciate the cause, they see the injustice, and then they got lives of their own, they gotta move on or whatever. Some people don't do it maliciously, right? And I'm gonna tell you the same exact thing that that brother said on stage. I've been here for 18 years, not as long as some people, but more time than others. And I've seen a lot of people come and go. I've seen famous people. I've seen celebrities. I've seen singers. I've seen rappers. I've seen politicians that needed a couple of extra votes. And I just wanted to say thank you to all the people that have stayed here for all this time. The familiar faces and the faces that are gonna be familiar in the future. Thank you very much. They asked me to, 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 to spit a poem. But before I do, I want to say not just a greeting to the revolutionaries and to the comrades in the building. I also want to say to the undercovers that aren't just some corny dude wearing headphones that fit in a lot better. We see you. We know what your agenda is. You don't need to make yourself known for us to know what, who you are and what you want, right? Shout out to the bike squad. There are a lot of new people I can see on that bike squad because they're definitely not in shape. But what I have to say is more important than making jokes. What I have to say is real, is that Mumia's case is something that many people, as I said in the very beginning, have forgot about because we've seen so many injustices since then. But we have to remember these names, right? Mumia Abu Jamal, right? We have to remember Amadou Diallo, Patrick Dorisman, these names that get lost in the 90s and the early 2000s, we can't allow their memory to become wiped away, to become obsolete. They are the people that are on the front lines right now. And with that said, I'm gonna give y'all a little poem from Harlem, New York, and I, I appreciate y'all love, man, thank you. Check it. They got a new housing plan for the ghetto eventually. Projects for a new American century. False flag terrorism controlling you mentally. The gospel in the hands of people with no empathy. A mixture of dangerous social chemistry between law enforcement and a military entity. Cameras on the corner of every corner you facing. Testing out a future Gestapo on immigration. Power, consolidation, information restricted. Just like the iron law of oligarchy predicted. Incarcerating the poor among the drug addicted. But not the families of the ruling class that's afflicted. Cause it's a fucking caste system Like corrupted Hinduism I've been through religion I've been through the system in prison I carried the cross as a Christian Like it was anti-disestablishment Terrianism Until the seeds of despotism Arrested my vision Lyricism with cynicism And syllogisms Until they Pedro Albi Sucampos And kill me in prison Chemtrail conditions Stem cells of Leo Strauss's philosophy The birth of neocon policy But I laugh at America's fear Of a new world order Controlling the hemisphere Cause my people been living that shit for for the past 500 years. I love you. Thank you very much. And together, when I say free, you say Mumia. Free! 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 Free all political prisoners. Bring them home. God bless y'all. Thank you very much for coming. New York City to Philly. Philly, we love you. Thank you very much. Stay in the fight. And please, Next year, bring your kids, you know? This revolution has to be built from the ground up. We love seeing the elders. I love seeing the young faces. I brought a young person here. That's my charge to every single person that's at this event. If you're gonna come back next year or come to another event, bring a young individual. Train an apprentice. Build the future, you know what I mean? Even if it's not your kid, bring somebody. Bring your nephew, bring your niece. Bring somebody from the hood that just needs, uh, can you watch him for two hours? All right, I'm gonna take him under the wing to some safe place where he can learn about the heroes of the past, those people that have been wiped out of history but are the reason that we're here. Thank you for paving the way to the OGs. Shout to the Black Panthers and the Cubs. We love you, respect. Free Mumia, power to the people.